Hey guys, so I wanted to come on here and do a quick little battery test with Honor 8 Pro comparing with some comparable handsets. We do have OnePlus 5, S8 Plus and iPhone 7 Plus. Uh, so we're going to check out the battery performance here and have a look at how it does compare because I am quite bored at the moment waiting for some new phones to arrive. So you know uh, why don't we check it out you can see they're all fully charged i think to the max we do have the dash charging on the one plus five uh, so we're just going to fire up uh, the standard uh, testing procedure here which is obviously the uh, game asphalt 8 which i think is a fantastic test of the gpu because it's quite uh, demanding here i'm going to show a look as well at the uh, starting temperature when it is charging so you can see the S8 Plus seems to run the hottest here can't see what uh, the temperature is on the iPhone unfortunately but it doesn't feel too warm when charging so it's not a huge deal uh, so we're going to jump right in and have a look at uh, how the gaming performance is all of them are on the full uh, brightness as you can see uh, let's just turn off NFC here with this one uh, so they're all like on the same kind of profile here get rid of Bluetooth with the iPhone and then we can do a hour of gaming with the asphalt so let's start it up here right so I think we're in a position to start here so we're just going to disconnect them all uh, from the power so we can get them racing so you can see they're all on battery power now uh, let's start them going so you can see quite a big uh, difference here in terms of the displays uh, with the S8 Plus kind of uh, destroying everything here and the OnePlus 5 is quite good as well frame rate keep, keeps quite constant I think on all of them because you'll have nice high end specifications so what is the time now 10.56 let's come back in an hour and uh, see you know who is going to be the best in terms of battery uh, I think it's going to be the S8 Plus because of a combination of a good size and good optimization of the software uh, Huawei is usually putting big batteries in their phones but they don't usually optimize it very well the EU MI uh, so it can be quite uh, annoying when you have a big battery but the performance is actually comparable to other phones at least according to GSM Arena uh, so yeah I will keep an eye on them as I'm doing this and I'll see you in an hour hey guys so I think uh, we are coming up to an hour here of some heavy gaming on these devices so we're going to see how the heat is as well as the battery life uh, you know it's quite uh, interesting this part of the video seeing you know which one is doing the best my one is still on the S8 Plus uh, followed by the OnePlus 5 then iPhone 7 Plus and then Honor uh, which I don't have much faith in in terms of the software but uh, we're going to check it out here so let's uh, start the uh, desktop here on all of them or home screen shall we say and have a look so we can see in terms of the uh, the CPU temp uh, Honor is running the hottest here uh, followed by the S8 Plus OnePlus 5 nice and cool I think Snapdragon really killed it this year in terms of the uh, like uh, the thermal kind of issue uh, so that is pretty nice this is an Exynos model obviously of the S8 Plus so uh, it does get cool quite quick though as you can see it seems to have calmed down in terms of the battery 
Uh, I think you can see here that we do have the worst performance on the Honor 8 Pro as I did anticipate. Uh, we have a draw here between OnePlus 5 and the uh, S8 Plus which is fantastic performance given the price of the OnePlus 5 as well as the fact that the battery isn't that big uh, in comparison. So it's all about the optimization here uh, as you can see in terms of the uh, battery. I don't even know what the battery is here on the uh, iPhone so we're just going to have a look at that. Uh, so what do we have? 78% Oh, so the iPhone did the worst here. I was expecting it to do at least better than Honor uh, but you can see 78% uh, it really seems to be draining quite quickly indeed. Uh, maybe it's got something to do with the latest software like iOS and all that. So I think you can see to conclude here, you know, big battery, while it is nice to have on a phone, it's not everything. Uh, you do uh, need some uh, good software optimization as well, and I think EMUI does need some improvement there. Uh, excellent performance from the OnePlus 5, as well as the fact you have the dash charging, which is the best in terms of charging. Really spoiled with that. Uh, once you go dash charging, you don't go back and the S8 Plus did pretty well in itself as well. So yeah, just a quick little battery and heat test comparison here, very interesting results, and I will see you in the next one. Cheers.